that's the sentiment today. It's, it's, it's an overwhelming, somber feeling. The U.S. government will not resume hearings on asylum claims Monday, as was expected. Late this afternoon, a federal judge in Louisiana blocked the administration from ending Title 42, the Trump era pandemic policy that turned migrants away out of concerns of COVID-19 spread. ABC 10 News reporter Laura Acevedo spoke with immigration groups who say they're disappointed, but not surprised. Local immigration rights leaders tell me that there were tears this afternoon when the migrants heard about the judge's ruling. Since early April, they had been looking forward to Monday, which would have marked the end of Title 42. News of the Title 42 ruling spread quickly. This is devastating news. Um, we're really sad and worried. Friday afternoon, Louisiana Judge Robert Summerhays blocked the Biden administration from ending the public health policy that denies migrants a chance to make their asylum claim. In a statement, the administration disagreeing with the ruling but vowing to enforce it. We hope that it ends immediately, but honestly, we were cautious and celebrating when we heard that Title 42 was going to be lifted. The judge ruled that the Biden administration didn't follow the right procedures in ending Title 42, saying that it was not exempt from giving a termination notice and allowing for a comment process, and that the CDC didn't explain why they were unable to provide that proper notice. Uh, Migrants waiting in shelters in Tijuana, like this man, say they don't understand why the government allows the processing of others, like Ukrainians but deny his attempt to make his asylum claim. We saw when Ukrainians arrived at the port of entry in Tijuana, thousands were processed within a matter of weeks. Border Angels Executive Director Dulce Garcia thinks the back and forth is politically motivated as midterm elections get closer. So it's a shame that both Republicans and Democrats would rather politicize this issue and support policies that are creating so much danger and harm in our communities. We did reach out to Republican Congressman Darrell Issa for comment about the ruling. In the past, he has been critical of the Biden administration's handling of immigration and Title 42. But as of right now, we have not heard back. The Department of Justice does plan on appealing this judge's ruling. From the U.S.-Mexico border, Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.